to some news from our sister city over in Juarez. Today, almost 1,000 migrants living in tents along the Rio Grande were removed by state and local police with the help of special tactic units. Officials with the state population office say the removal was necessary because more and more children and adults were experiencing hypothermia or getting pneumonia from cold weather conditions. There were also reports of some fights during the removal and some tents were burned in the operation. We have gone through a lot for our children. We have been through a lot just to get here, and they do this to us. Some migrants agreed to go to shelters. Others agreed to leave the camp, but said they wouldn't travel too far from the Rio Grande while they wait on what the U.S. federal government decides to do about Title 42 next month.